One of Garden Grove's most memorable football coaches passed away Friday morning. 41-year-old Joe Hayes' wife, Nicole, said the former coach was not wearing an oxygen mask to treat his sleep apnea when he went to bed. The accomplished physical education teacher is best known for leading the 2009 varsity football team through one of the program's most trying times. Same thing they did. I loved him uh, like a brother and like a friend, and he was the heart and soul of this football team. And um, I know this team will go on. And Garden Grove Argonaut head coach Joe Hay is talking about senior lineman Kevin Tellis, who passed away on the field September 11, 2009, during the opening game of the season. Tellis died of an undiagnosed heart condition. The loss of a team leader and standout like Tellis might have crushed another team, but not Hayes Garden Grove Argos. He really just galvanized everybody. Uh, he, he, was a, he was a great leader. He was a great leader of men. That football season they had was, was just one for the ages. Uh, and, and he spearheaded all of that. He'll, he'll, he'll be sorely missed. Coach Hay took the team through an incredible season, remaining undefeated until the CIF title game against La Mirada. The team had wanted to dedicate the championship to Kevin Tellis, but even after the defeat, Coach Hay sought to rally his team. Be proud of what you've accomplished and what you've been through. And look around at the guys in this, on this team, and you'll never forget any of them. The season was full of triumphs for the first-year head coach. Along with the league championship, Hay was named ABC7 Coach of the Year in a ceremony at Garden Grove High School. He had to leave his beloved Argos after the season to undergo shoulder replacement surgery. He remained at the school teaching health science. Hay held a Master's of Science degree in health education and was on the faculty of Golden West and Saddleback Colleges. Hay's unexpected passing has deeply affected the Garden Grove community. We're, we're stunned by it. it. It came completely out of the blue and many of the, the football kids, the kids who had him as a teacher, are stunned as well. I know he's up there resting in, resting in peace. Um, he, was, you know, he was just a great coach. I mean, he, he picked us up when everyone was down and he, he just he showed us what a true team was all about. The last day of uh, school, I went up to him, I shook his hand and I told him, I hope I see you next year, coach, and I, I hope I see you next year as a teacher as well but I guess it didn't happen. I hope you rest in peace. A celebration of life will be held at the Balboa Island American Legion Post on February 12, 2012 from 4 to 7 p.m. All of us at Channel 3 want to convey our condolences to Coach Hayes' family and the Garden Grove High School community.